Hi, this is Myra Scraybeck, and I'm going to be talking just a little bit today about Dyslexia House Bill 1886. In summary, House Bill 80, 1886 is effective as of September 1, 2017. It requires education service centers to employ a person licensed as a dyslexia therapist to help school districts with support and resources. Students must be screened or tested for dyslexia at the end of kindergarten and first grade. TEA will develop a list of training opportunities for educators regarding dyslexia that meet the requirements of TEC Section 21054B regarding continuing education. Training opportunities for educators pertaining to dyslexia satisfy requirements under TEC Section 21. 054 regarding continuing education may include an online opportunity. Currently, Module 1 of the Texas Dyslexia Identification Academy is online and available for educators. There is more information in the Texas Dyslexia Handbook revised in 2014 regarding continuing education requirements for dyslexia. What does the passing of House Bill 1886 mean for districts? Screening for Dyslexia. H -bill, uh, House Bill 1886 requires that all students shall be screened specifically for dyslexia at the end of kindergarten and the end of first grade. Screening instruments used will be determined by the LEA. Dyslexia specialists at, at ESCs. House Bill 1886 requires each ESC to employ a dyslexia therapist to provide local education agencies the support and resources necessary to assist students and families of students with dyslexia. The specific screener to be used is up to the local education agency. Region 10 does employ a licensed dyslexia therapist, Marcy Isinger, to help support districts in and families, students and families of students with dyslexia. Region service centers will be available to support districts as they implement these requirements. Of course, at any point, if a student is suspected of having dyslexia, then the identification process would need to be explored following the guidance from the Dyslexia Handbook, which was revised in 2014. If you have any questions, please contact Marcy Isinger at 972-348-1454 or email her at marcy.isinger at region10.org.